What's going on guys? Josh Sykes back with you for OutdoorNewsAmerica.com doing our breaking news coverage of the firearms industry. This is the second week of February 2023 and what I do each week is I try to pull my top five stories, five or six stories that I think you guys would be most interested in, what you would like to hear about in the industry. So topping my list this week is Trailblazer Firearms. Ugh, I got a little tongue tied. Trailblazer Firearms has announced this week that if you buy one of their Pivot nine millimeter rifles send in the rebate on their website trailblazerfirearms.com you can receive a free 22 long rifle life card handgun if you haven't seen this thing folds up it's about the size of a cell phone pretty cool little device uh, so you got a limited time to get this opportunity so if you buy their pivot you get the free life card 22 check them out i'll put the website up here trailblazerfirearms.com I think that is a, uh, a definitely no-brainer if you're in the market for one of their pivot rifles. Second on my list today, Primary Arms launched their new binocular line. Okay, this is something cool. Let's check this out and see how it does. There's basically two versions. They're both 10 by 42 millimeter. You got the SLX version and the GLX version. Now the SLX version, I wouldn't say lower quality, but probably the glass, the clarity, things of that nature are gonna be a little less on the, on the SLX version versus the GLX. SLX version is gonna come in at 129. GLX version is gonna come in at $260 MSRP. So if you're a guy that's looking for a lot of clarity and definition looking downrange, the GLX is probably better for you. If you're like me and you just don't see that darn well, and you want to see down the range a little bit better, the SLX is probably a much better choice for a lower price point. Third thing on my list this year, SHOT Show has launched that they're going to be doing an archery section at SHOT Show in 2024. And this is a partnership with Grandview Outdoors. So Grandview Outdoors, a lot of people might not know them. They've been in the publishing industry in this, in this industry for a long, long time. They're really big in the archery side. I believe they do the ATA show. They're kind of primarily responsible for that. So they're going to try to bring in and attract some more visitors for SHOT Show. I think they're going to have a dedicated archery section for you to shoot crossbows and things of that nature. I'm looking forward to checking that out. I don't have a lot of experience in that area, but I think it'd be really cool while I'm at SHOT Show to learn a little bit more about the archery side of business. Check it out while I'm there. If you're going to SHOT Show next year, put that on your must-see list. Third thing, fourth thing I want to talk about is Henry. Henry Rifles has announced their new Homesteader 9mm carbine. If you haven't seen this thing, it's pretty cool. It's a 9mm carbine rifle, lever action style, okay? I talked about the Bond Arms last week, so this is the Henry answer to that. This rifle's coming out at a price point of about $930, but one of the things that's really cool and unique about this one is you can get it in a multiple format magazine, Glock, Smith & Wesson, SIG. You've got your options, five round, 10 round option. So it's kind of like pick what you want, depending on what you shoot on a regular basis. It's a cool little rifle, check it out. Website, henryusa.com, really cool option there. Now, the last thing I wanna talk about today is something that uh, I think is pretty darn cool. I did not know this was even in existence until I went to SHOT Show this year. The National Association, the National African American Gun Rights Association. I think this is phenomenal. This year I got to spend some time with them at SHOT Show. They had a booth at SHOT Show. I learned a lot about the organization. Actually coming up in about 160 days from now, they're gonna be having a convention in Atlanta, Georgia that's gonna have booth space. There's gonna be manufacturers there. They're gonna have educational sessions. Uh, they do a lot of training, a lot of safety things, and just a lot of awareness to the Second Amendment, uh, about Second Amendment rights. N-A-A-G-A dot C-O. N-A-A-G-A dot C-O. You may have heard of this. I have not, and I just think this is a great opportunity uh, to learn more and to grow more awareness about the Second Amendment. Last thing I want to mention today, I want to give a big shout out to my buddy Matt. If you're not familiar, Matt has a channel on YouTube and I'll post a link down in the description called Bama Beach Bum. They launched a new tackle store today. So if you ever go to the Panhandle of Florida, you got to check out Beach Bum Outdoors. Right now you can go online, Beach Bum Outdoors, and, and, and actually purchase product for your fishing excursion. But if you really want to learn a lot about saltwater fishing, about beach fishing, 
uh, about all that goes into that, catching some really cool species from the beach, you got to check out Matt's channel, Bama Beach Bum on YouTube, and then their store, Beach Bum Outdoors. You can buy just about anything from tackle, rods, reels, all the things that you're going to need on your excursion when you go out and do some fishing. So be sure and check those guys out. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this little segment on the hot news uh, in this week's in the, in the outdoor industry. I hope you enjoy our channel. If you do, please subscribe down below. Give us a thumbs up. Leave us a comment. Leave us a suggestion. We want to hear from you. And until next time, we'll talk to you soon.